Present Day Finale today announced that each Guyanese 18 years and above will receive a $100,000 one off cash grant. This effectively scraps the $200,000 one off cash grant per household, which was announced last Thursday in Parliament. The announcement was made during a live on Facebook, and according to the President, the change was in direct response to feedback received on the concerns of Guyanese. That instead of the one off cash grant of $200,000 to every household previously announced, my government will now expand this benefit by providing a one-off cash grant of $100,000 to every citizen of Guyana 18 years and above as of the 1st of January 2024, with a simple means of verification being possession of a national valid identification card and or a valid passport. So fellow Guyanese, this measure it's now aimed at reducing the risk, the complexities, the conflict that were previously alluded to by citizens in their outreach to the cabinet and in my personal engagement. Of course, this new measure of transferring $100,000 to every Guyanese 18 years and above and 18 years and and above at a qualifying date of the 1st of January 2024 will cost well in excess of the $60 billion previously allocated for the one-off household grant. It addresses the many concerns by young people who may not yet have a family, but who thought in their discourse with us that they will not benefit from the household allocation because they were not yet the head of the household. This new initiative will now take into consideration those persons and expand the benefit to those young professionals also. You also said that tuition fees will be abolished at all technical vocational institutes. That the tuition fees will also be abolished at all government technical and vocational training institutions, including all of the technical institutes the Guyana Industrial Training Center, the Carnegie School of Home Economics, the Guyana School of Agriculture, all of these, the tuition fees will now be abolished. This measure will benefit an additional, in excess of an additional 3,000 persons in our population. Former Finance Minister under the AP and UAFC Coalition Government, Winston Jordan, had suggested that every adult Guyanese resident in Guyana be given a $100,000 grant which removes all the challenges that could arise with the distribution of the $200,000 grant. 